Hey everyone, Technomancy here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone charging port not working. So let's get started. Now, when it comes to fixing your iPhone charging port, first thing you want to verify is that there's no dust or debris or any kind of lint blocking that charge port. Now, sometimes it's really hard to see, so you have to use a flashlight with another flashlight or another phone and take something non-metal like to be able to pick at it to see if there's any dust or debris that could be blocking the connection. Now, you don't want to use anything metal because it could damage it. And it'll look really easy to see it. Sometimes if you have a uh, a compressor, you can also use that to try to go get it, but you need something tiny to be able to just pick at it and you'll see that a connection sometimes are blocked due to basically link dust, anything that gets into it blocking or clogging up that charging port. Now the next thing you want to do if you're having issue is that if you recently put on a case, maybe it's not making the connection, take off the case and try to charge it. Along with that, you might want to consider that maybe it's not the charging port, it could be your uh, your charger so th think about the two parts when it comes to a charger the cable sometimes these can get defective when they are bending or twisting or even the wall uh, adapter so see if that charger works on another phone just to verify that it's not the charger that's not working and not the actual charge port so another thing to verify and then also try a different outlet so if you've been using the same outlet sometimes an outlet can go bad so just go at a different outlet to make sure that isn't the issue as well now along with that is that you want to go ahead and also make sure that your phone is at an ideal temperature if it's too hot try to cool it down some more because when it's really extreme hot temperature very hot phone won't charge to prevent it from getting damaged now the same also goes if it's too cold you want to go somewhere it's warmed up the extreme weather will prevent your phone from charging correctly and it might not necessarily be the charging board now after you have done that go ahead and plug everything and then we're going to follow this step first thing is you're going to press and you're going to go ahead and press and release the volume up press and release the volume down and then hold on to the side button just like i'm doing again i pressed and released the volume up and then volume down followed by holding on to the side button. it's going to say slide to power off but do not touch that just keep on holding that side button just like i am we're going to wait for the screen to go black and the apple logo to appear at that time you'll let go of that side button and what we have done is known as a force restart which basically shuts down the phone software, reloads the code, so if it's a software related issue, it's causing that charging port not to work, it will fix it. And if it doesn't work the very first time, don't worry, keep on trying it a few times. This method is completely safe, it will not delete any of your personal data on your iPhone, so everything from your photos, our videos, apps, everything will still be there. You don't have to worry about that. Now, after you have done that and it's still not working, it's time to go into your settings and go to general and then look to see if there's a software update available. If there is, go ahead and update your phone to the latest version because sometimes a previous version might have caused the issue where the charging port is not working. And lastly, other things to consider is that if you can't get it to charge using the charging port, you can consider a wireless charger as well. Most iPhones nowadays have wireless charging, so if you have a wireless charger, try to charge it that way to verify that the phone can charge uh, at all as well. And then also, if the wet, if your charger or the uh, charging port is wet, make sure you dry it before you connecting to any charger. And lastly, if none of this work, it might be because the charging port is damaged or defective. In that case, it does have to actually get replaced since it's a hardware. But in any case, I hope this video was helpful in fixing your charging port on your iPhone. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.